A small companion looked like he had something he wanted to say. What is it, Dicey? Yeah. Who you're now, you're my friend. Yeah. We're helping people remember that you're strong, but you're not scared. You're good. Moving those statues because you can't do things others can't doesn't mean you're bad. If you want the truth, then yes, I'm at first how scared of you. I think you're like family too. Yeah. I mean, you literally help us out. I think you meet some family when you're not when you're born. Others you meet later on when you're both ready. I do kind of wish I understood what Dicey was saying, but hey, that wrong direction. So that's all the side quest. Yep, six out six side quest. Still two cards to find, but we'll probably get those for main quest. And we got the storybook page, so we're almost completely done with freedom, except for the main quest. Okay, we got all the things you need. What were we talking about again? <laughs> oh yeah, we have this pinky we got from the Count. Yes, uh, who that does it finger, belong to? It reminds me of something. It was the fight with the the king, and he, and I, and we... Ugh, I, I'm afraid it's gone. But it's become clearer. Bring me more. I need yeah, more I, to remember. I still think it's either the queen who killed the king, or more likely her. Who killed the king? What were we talking about again? Okay, yeah, we've been to Duke. He gave us a portrait. Oh, yep. That portrait of the children, the triplets, and their father, their poor father, the king, killed, killed while I, while he, I, uh, I can't remember. I need more. Oh, for God's sakes. More objects to jog my poor memory. Don't worry, we gotcha. What were we talking about again? Yeah. Gave your old arm. arm. I remember. I wore this. I used this to help defend the king when he... On that night when he... But then it... Oh, it's Then gone. it broke or got taken? It's gone. Please bring me more objects. I'm so close to remembering. I can feel it. Okay, we got one last what item. We talking the about weapon. Again? By the dice maker. I remember this. It came for us so quickly, so savage, we couldn't... Uh, it's on the tip of my tongue, and then it's gone. It's... I'm sorry, even. What were we talking about? <sighs> the night the king died. Well, I'm afraid I need to jog my memory. We gave you Please old bring items. Me more objects. It's all I need to remember. Now, can you remember who murdered King Star this war? Yes, we yes, gave you all the objects. You've, you've done it. Seeing them all together, I I remember everything. Oh, by the dice maker. So who did me. it? Oh, there's a count. Baroness. Alright. Which one of you and pranksters do rang the bell? I knew it was a trap! Assassins! Oh, ah, shush, children! Niska! You're alive! You should all be ashamed to have disgraced your father's beloved freedom so, and how proud he was of you. But bloody this is just not how he raised you. <laughs> Listen, I was there that doomed night when your father was murdered. And Nishka the bodyguard recounted vividly what had happened that night. It was a tale of a god lady gone awry, of a blade against mechanical arm, and a cold-blooded murder. I was but who did it? Oh my dice. Well, that's how fights were done in those days. But this murderer didn't play by the rules. My trusty arm was cut off. I returned the favor and tore off the perpetrator's finger. And that perpetrator was... The Shadow Man! Oh! Bernie! Oh, hey! Oh, I didn't even think about it being the Shadow Man! I should have been there to guide you all. I went mad with guilt for failing your father, and I ran away. I am so sorry. And it appears that this war might have been for naught. 
This war was all because you three never talked to each other? Yep. You people are the worst! Eh, she's not wrong, yeah. And I called it. I knew that it couldn't have been any of the siblings. It was too obvious. But I didn't think it was the Shadow Man. My money was still on the on the Queen or uh, Nishka. I can find my way home to one cross with my eyes closed. Easy peasy. Don't worry, even. I'll make sure he gets home. And good luck to you. I'm not good at goodbyes. Say hi to Odd. Oh, I almost forgot. You like Pips, right? This is all that was left of Mr. Shady when you poofed him. Weird, huh? Oh, ah. <laughs> thank you. Okay, we can use those to hey, fix up hey Dicey. Guys. But now we need to find Seymour. <gasps> Here goes nothing. Bada boom. Rollmaster's bow. Yeah, we got the bow. And we got some Dice Pips, nice. Thank you, Bernard. Hey, even. Kind of surprised you don't want to, yeah, want to help us. Oh heck, <laughs> I just found it in there. I figured it might do something cool in some card game, but I don't know. I More of like war it. and combat, what but are still. For, right? Have you seen Odd yet? I wish I had. Well, I mean, no, I don't wish I had. Because being a Sixer is supposed to be magical, but that nanny was just really mean to everyone. So it's good that I haven't seen her, because that means the nanny hasn't gotten her. At least, not yet. I'm sorry, even. It's been a crazy day. I just want to go home. Was it hard to my parents for me? I just feel bad about leaving him? Yeah, we sure, did kind of just leave him while they were asleep. I just hope your dad isn't still mad at me for breaking that teapot. That was you. I got in so much trouble for that. <laughs> well, <laughs> then he won't be mad at me at all. <laughs> okay, then. Sure, I'll tell him no problem. Tell him about the teapot, too. Oh, man. <laughs> fine, fine. I'll tell him. But he better be so happy to hear from you that he won't be mad at me. Well, bye. Uh, oh, even? Uh, before I go, I just wanted to say... I hope you find your sister soon. I always liked her, even. I'm sure she's safe. She can defend herself. After all, she's a great puncher. <laughs> Thanks, Bernie. Okay. Oh, wrong direction. Okay. Let's see how well this goes, because I feel like they're going to catch us. That or we'll get outed by a Lucky. Actually, I feel like that's what's going to happen. She's going to get outed out by Lucky. Okay, see you later. And off we go. I am a bit sad we didn't get like an actual proper boss fight. I mean, we got a board game boss fight, but it wasn't really that much fun. I was hoping we'd fight like one of the giant robots or something. But I guess not. Aw. Bit of a let down there, but eh, it's fine. So this is the inside of a wool okay, hi. Sure. It's interesting seeing the robots not trying to actually kill us for once. So this is the inside of one of these spider gondolas. Uh, gondolas. Let's take a look around. It looks like a giant... Almost like a pillow fort. I mean, the, the floors, everything's made out of, like, pillows. Oh, I didn't think it was possible, oh, but I no ate money, too no. much candy. Well, it's just about candy. Oh, it's you. Are you happier? I'm full of candy here, so... Yes? Can we save all of us? Without candy? 
How are you gonna save anyone without candy? Do you have candy? We had lots of candy in Five Tropolis, but not anymore. Uh, no. Can How I have some? How are you gonna save anyone without candy? Uh, I don't know. Can I have some? I mean, is it really that important? I'm scared. Eh, that's okay. And you still look like one of the pea shooters from Plants vs. Zombies. You somehow look uglier. Thanks, that's a fun way to pronounce heroic. Bernie, is that you? Your voice sounds different. I'm not Bernie. Are you sure not Bernie? You have the same number of limbs as Bernie. What odds two humans would both have four limbs? Everyone else that doesn't look like a pea shooter? <laughs> I remember their names. Wait, you're not all named Bernie? Oh no. <laughs> eh, Corv. It was nice to meet you. Oh, there's Dicey. Okay, so. Oh, I see. We need to get to our bun over here. I'm guessing the nanny is probably in like the control area of this place. So, yep. looks like I need to go up there. How are you here, Manny? Okay. Dice passing on a charge is once charged. Always get to hear dice ice number. That that's not the most helpful, honestly. Not unless we were to have all six, but we only have three for now till we find Seymour. Uh, let, let, you know what, let's save up our coins. You okay there? Uh, hello? Whoa! I'm thinking happy thoughts, so I don't remember reality. My mom Fair enough. That back in Fortown. She grew up during the war. The big one. The no dice war? So much, I thought this would be fun. But... But... You're getting, ha You're getting homesick. A nice warm blanket on a cold night. We're all scared, that yeah. That makes me feel a bit better. Do you have any happy thoughts? Think about future better than today. Think about how great things going to be once I see my sister. Think about fixing well all of this. Better future better than today, things I guess. Things being better forever. That's a happy thought. Things being better forever with ice cream and puppies and hugs and moms and dads and families and cookies and kittens and cookies shaped like kittens and made out of ice cream. Uh, okay. Uh oh. That's not a good sign. There's already enemy cards in here, then. Yep, and there's crystals. Yeah, we're going to have to fight some enemies in here. Oh, please, and we can fight the nanny as a boss. That would be fun. I heard they have unicorn ponies in Six Town. I don't know what that is, but okay. Then there's Lucky. Oh no, she's gonna rat out on us to the nanny. Oh what no. What are you doing here? I'm yourself. I don't think so. I'm Nanny's favorite, so that makes me the most important kid. You're not important. Okay, well, good for you. Yes, it is good for me. I always knew I was a sixer, and finally, the rest of the world is acting like it. Honestly, some of the kids here, you can put them in a sixer uniform, but you can't change who they are, and... Wait a minute. Even? Even! It's me, Lucky from One Town! What are you doing here? Did she not realize... Are these guys just blind? <laughs> Uh, am I not doing anything sneaky? Um, you clearly are. What's going on? Wait a second. You're not even 12 yet. You're too young to be... She's gonna rat us out. an imposter. Lucky, listen. No, you listen, even. I roll the quince dice to get here, and you're... You're a cheater. She's gonna rat us you out. You don't belong here. You're an imposter. You're an imposter. I'm telling. Nanny... Nanny Fatuna, Nanny. Uh oh. 
possible. Yep, I called it. Eh, yeah, not all of them. Boss fight time, yep. Here we go. Okay. I'm guessing I need to get her to break these because I was seeing crystals appearing on her. Yep. That's not even many crystals. Okay, it's enough for two cards. That's it. Jeez, we're going to need a lot more crystals. As I accidentally jumped right to that. A free, good. Okay, let's do this. Let's stack these and do one of the bows. Can the bow stack? Doesn't matter. Okay, where... Oh, there she is. Let's go and get some hits on her. Okay, that's decent damage. Uh-oh. Oh, no, you don't. Wait, why is she just waiting to center? Because she has a bomb. That accidentally kills your own minions. Yeah, maybe not the smartest of plans. Okay, let's see. Curse, curse, that could be helpful. The lance, not until... Hmm. Let's not use the lance until we're at least done with the sword first. The hammer? Come on. Fine, let's do Crystal Curse. Try and get her to break the crystal. Okay, that did not work, as I was hoping. There we go. He's gonna end you without even trying. Okay, let's do that. Do this. The elixir, I don't really need it right now. Withdrawal will be helpful here. We'll go ahead and do elixir and... The sword's already close to breaking. Let's give the lance a try. Let's see how much damage it does. Okay, not bad. We'll have to see how it scales. Dang, I was hoping you would hit. Oh. Okay, come on. Full hand. Okay, none of these are really what I was hoping for. If I do another one to bows, what happens? Okay, so it adds the arrows. It doesn't double the damage like it does with like the swords. It but it does double the arrows. So that is helpful. Not the most helpful here. Okay. Let's do the hammer. Yeah, stop moving. You're just a one -er. No one's gonna miss you. Nanny's gonna crush you under her show. Bring it on. No. Ah, no, she's using the bombs. Of course. There we go. Let me give you some Nerf full hand. We'll go with this, and that's all I can do. Oh, wait a minute, hold on. If she's doing a crushing, then... Nope, she's still doing the bombs. Ow, okay, might need elixir soon. Okay. 
Okay, one more hit. And... Uh, okay. Are you serious? That's the one drawback about the hammer as well. It's slow moving. Come on, give me a full hand. There we go. Okay, what we got? Hey, okay. Gotta admit, not exactly the most helpful. We'll take the elixir. I need to switch out elixir for maybe one of the more stronger ones. We're starting to take more damage now. And that's all we have. So, bone arrow time. What if I were to shoot the bombs while they're in her hand? That worked! Oh, that's so cool. I ate children long before, and you were... I'm sorry, did you say you ate children? Okay, apparently she's like Bobby Yaga. Okay, and there goes him. And us. Yeah, I didn't think we'd make it to six Opolis that easily. Now we still have like two other areas to look at. And there goes Dicey. Here, take my hand. Uh oh. She's gonna betray us for the queen. This is for your own good, Wanna. Yeah, maybe that was not the best thing to do. So I'm guessing we're landing whatever the four kingdom is called. And now we're in another nightmare, slash dream, and or connected memory. It's hard to tell sometimes. Is this one just an infinite staircase? Two sisters, both alike in dignity. But within one woman lies dark malignity. I don't know what that means, but okay. I think that just means one has darkness or stuff like that. Fun and games. Oh, hey, Mayor. One is gone. Some and Royum. Okay, sounds like they're basically saying there's always a dark side to everyone or something like that. Come on, I know this stuff already. I played Kingdom Hearts. Come on. Still don't know what you are. You rules to make the present He was like a floating organ, like some sort of heart or something. Death and ruin for those who oppose. As went the sister, so the whole world goes. Okay. What are we going to see at the top over here, though? I... I don't think I can do this. You can, and you will. The sacrifice is necessary. But I don't want to. The dice demands it. Sacrifice? Sometimes we must set aside what we want in order to get what we need. For the odd. Push her over. Oh, and that's lucky. Odd, please. I'm sorry I was mean to you and your sister. Odd, please, you can't do this. You can't. You're running out of time, Odd. So is this actually what happened or just a dream? Because it actually is what's happening, then I'm guessing Lucky's probably dead now. Sacrifice for Odd. Why did you, why did you do... She's being corrupted and manipulated by the Queen. Dicey? Dicey! Even knew she had to find her missing friend. She gathered her courage, squared her shoulders, and... I just want to go home. <sighs> And realized that she just wanted to go home. It's a bit too late for that now. Home was very far away. Yeah. She had no idea how to get there. Actually, we don't even know where we are now. I guess whatever the Four Kingdoms is called, but I don't know if this is it. Hey, 
It's a well? Don't tell me Dicey's in a well. Okay, thank you, Ominous Echo. Well, things are safe to say Dicey's not in there. Oh, I heard a little spider robot minions. Okay, we gotta sneak past them. Uh oh. Hmm. Okay. Wait, which way do I need to go? Okay, that doesn't look like a lead anywhere, but over here, though. Is this the four land? It seems very destroyed and kind of abandoned. Ow! Ow! Oh, this might be that four kingdom. Because when we saw a little like found herself approaching the edge of Forberg. Yep, Forberg, that's what's called. The silent remains of that once glorious city. Yeah, this is where that Torn war happened. East is during the war years ago in a mad search for something. Yeah, a no dice of war. It at all, with the ruined and lifeless stones shrouded in fog, lost to memory. So this is where the war took place, the No Dice War. But why destroy the whole city? Um, that's a Even giant Ferris wheel dice. Vision. Something she could scarcely believe. A rebuilt fort town, squatting hmm. by the ruins of what came before. A city without history. But who called it home? Maybe survivors from the war? That's my guess. And by the giant dice Ferris wheel. Are those cards? Oh, now this starting to feel like Alice in Wonderland more and more. And some kind of casino chips? Yeah, okay. Why does this remind me of that, like, the island from uh, Pinocchio? The one where, uh, kids got turned to donkeys at. Thank you. Uh, I was expecting him to ask for a password or something, but I guess not. Yeah, it's like a carnival, kind of like a They're Ferris, like a fair. Uh, no, thank you, Stone. Prove it! Ain't no laws in Forberg, kid. But come on, come on, come cheating. on! Show me what you got! What you got? No. Yeah, this reminds me a lot of Island from Pinocchio. So it's like a giant fun fair kind of thing. Ladies and gentlemen, foremen and everyone else, Forbergers and foreigners, I present to you for the first time on the casino main stage a real. Uh oh, there's Dicey. Yep. Dicey! He has Dicey. What manner of destruction will it unleash upon these fighting grounds? What rules and norms? It's an arena. Okay, of course it is. Also, is he same as like Nanny Fortuna? There's only one way to find out. <laughs> when I roll them bones. Why isn't it doing anything? Come on, give it a kick. Oh, worthless. Dicey. Dicey! I'm not leaving here without you, Dicey. Yeah, Leave the power to dice alone. doesn't work unless dice is you're a dice wielder. Protection. Oh, what a fine job you've been doing of it too. 
but I am always up for a gamble. Bring it on. I could play some blackjack. Or, of course, arena fight. Even I saw that coming. Yeah, I see the giant rook cards everywhere. That's not exactly a good sign. Okay, regular armored ones. Oh yeah, Dicey, he's hurt. Ladies and gentlemen, the death match is yep. about to begin. And there's a rook. Uh oh, that's not good. There's a lot of them. Okay, let's do this. The bone arrow. And a lance. Yep, grab as many as you can. Why do you want our bones? Let's do this. I could go for a double sword, but I kind of want to see about the lance. No, let's just continue trying to get that lance. Come on, get the crystal. There we go. Go grab a crystal, Dicey. Oh, that's helpful. I'd pay real money if you shut up. Okay, we got free. Good. Okay, so yes. Okay, so we can stack up the lances. Good. Okay, we'll use this, get another dice. Seriously? Okay, we'll get the... Let's get this one. Oh yeah, that does a lot more damage. Come on, Dicey. Dicey, come on. Do this. Do this. Do I have enough for the hammer? We'll do the bone arrow. But first, always take out the range attackers. Or. We need to get rid of. Ow! Oh, oh, aw. I was actually doing well in that fight. that this wasn't even a dice after all. What we have here is just a broken old jack-in-the-box. <laughs> He's mine. Give him back. You want this garbage back? Yes, and he's not garbage. Well, go get it. Oh, that's just mean. Okay, I hope we get to fight him as a boss. And we actually were winning that fight. And the pips are just following us. But I don't even think those pips will work unless we get Seymour. Unless there's another person who could repair a dice. Oh, it looks like he's still alive. Just a little hurt. Oh, Dicey. I was so scared. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to get you hurt. I should have never put you in danger. We don't belong here. And I just, I just want to go home. Did someone say, smuggle me home? No! Because you, little lady, are in the presence of Ludo Betts, the greatest person smuggler in all of random. Y okay. You trust me, right? Nope. Person smuggler. Smuggler, runner, pirate, pathfinder, it's all the same thing, just with a different coat of paint. And I'm the best there is at doing it. You see, I've got my bag. Top of the line, nothing so fine, purely benign. Okay, can stop it arriving. What makes your bag so special? It's bigger on the inside. Me and my brother can fit anyone inside. So it's basically the TARDIS sorry, from I mean, Doctor Who? I can. My brother, Bruno... I lost him to the high roller. 
who I'm betting you know. We gambled, mm -hmm. we lost, and now he owns him. And you, well, you've got yourself a real dice, which means you have a real chance to free Bruno. Do that, and I'll be real motivated to do you a favor in turn. Can we sketch? I don't want to be involved. I just fought and we lost. Hmm. I mean, he is kind of sketchy, but we just fought him and lost. Because you don't have enough pips. Any fool can see that. Look, the high roller seems all high and mighty, but he's got a weakness. It's in his name. Roll a higher number than his, and he'll lose everything. Okay. You just gotta fix your dice up. He's already being mean, dicey up and once, yeah. And you're gonna let that stand. Take revenge. Show him who's boss. Solve okay. both our problems in one fell swoop. Got a point. We do want revenge. Beat the high roller. Then you'll save Bruno. And I swear on my eyes that I'll let you inside my bag. And me and my brother will take you anywhere you want. Anywhere. Okay. Even that seems fair no enough. I idea where she could find more darts for her dice. So she fell back to exploring. It well, I mean, that is what we're good at. Far, at least, which, if we're being precise, is to a point where she no longer wanted to explore. That's fair enough. Look, life's complicated sometimes. Okay, well, let's check out the map. Okay, so there's one story page. Only four side quests. Okay, side quests never usually take too long. Nine cards. Wow, okay. Okay, well, let's start off over here. You don't have a quest for us. And we can't go back that way. Okay, there's side quest up here. Okay. Here we go. It should be number six. Yep. A new queen rose to power, and knowing what the games had become, took action. In a voice tinged with rage, she decreed that all dice be forever destroyed. Using the power of her dark, six-sided companion, called the One True Dice, she attacked any of her citizens foolish enough to protest. And thus began the No Dice War. So that's how it began. Okay. I know you do. Oh, <laughs> uh, we got some coins. <laughs> Welcome to Forburg. You gotta go where the business is. I don't figure that old Foreman will buy from me someday. Hey, buddy. Excuse me. Hey, mate. Why so glum? We found each other and now we can talk and trade cards. <laughs> Life doesn't get any better than this, you know. I'm feeling too infused about cards now. See? Now I know there's something wrong. Now listen, mate, I know things get bleak sometimes. Truth is, this was my hometown once. Born and raised here. Oh, so you're from Forbert. The town got ruined by, uh, you know who. The Queen. And it's, it's weird to be back. Nothing ever stays the same. You turn your back for one moment and, well, you can look around to see what happens. Yeah. But things get better, right? They have to. Otherwise, they just stay like this, mate. And I don't know how to handle that. Oh, anyway. Enough about me feeling sad. You know what I'd rather feel? Happy? I'd rather feel cards in my hands. Okay, as we yep. Trade them, eh? <laughs> cards in hands as we trade them. <laughs> you took the words right out of me, cabinet. That's because you're the one who said them. Okay. Now, let's see. What do I want? Quick draw can be helpful. Let's... Let me get the super potion. Yeah, let's start trying to maybe get some of these more healing related stuff. Thank you, Manny. Always helpful. Forberg Square. Okay, so it's like we need to go. I've never been to the Soothsayer District. People disappear in there. Okay. With powers they shouldn't. Got you. 
So this is where we need to go. And I think we've found where we can fix up Dice Eater, Seymour. We'll talk to him in a minute, or talk to him right now. <laughs> talk about beginner's luck. Seymour, what are you doing here? Hey, He's here to play some games. Man. Sorry, guys, uh, I got a bounce. <laughs> My friend, it's good to see you. Made it to Forberg, huh? Hey, how goes the brave quest? Not um, going too well. I'm heading home, Seymour. But I don't see your sister with you. Jeez, uh, I, I don't know what I'm doing anymore, Seymour. I'm, st I'm starting to think I don't even know who Odd is. Maybe I never did. Nah, Maybe it's it corruption and manipulation from the to Queen. Her, to anyone. We all just... We all disappoint other people, don't we? And here I am disappointing you. Hmm. <laughs> That's all you say, Seymour. Right. <laughs> so, you want to go home. Let's start there. You certain about this? I'm not certain about anything. That just tells you you're alive. Life's a roll of the dice, right? It's okay to want to go home. It's okay to feel lost or be lost and to just take things one step at a time. Do you know your way back? No, but this guy Ludo bets he says he can smuggle us back, yeah. I will say this. For a woman who seems so disheartened and pessimistic, you've certainly had a lot of success meeting people and securing passage. That is true. These towns weren't numbered se 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 sequentially. I'd be completely lost. Uh, thank the dice makers for their foresight for that then. Uh, I'd bring you myself, if I could. I'm uh, kind of lost myself. <laughs> you try and get back to two town? There's a guy who said he could smuggle me. Yeah. That does sound like a possibility. Let me guess. You need to get his brother back from the high roller. Yeah? And the yep. high roller only ever rolls fours. So if you could roll a five. Can you help us? Even. Easy, easy. I was just getting that part. Here, pass the little guy over. So we just add in the dots he had in two town. And now the extra dots you found back in three dumb. It's not enough, is it? It's not enough to get to five, is it? It's enough for four, but probably not five. To roll three, I bring him to roll four, but not a five. Ta da! <laughs> Meet your new improved, more repaired dicey. Now you can roll up to. Only a four. We need more pips. Um, four. Which is still not enough to beat the high roller. Sorry, even. Well, I know where you could find some more dots, but... Uh, forget I said anything. Uh, where? It's dangerous. So is everywhere we've been. There's no guarantee of success. That's to roll the dice for you. Fine, fine. Just don't tell her I'm the one who sent you. Even... Go to the soothsayer tents and ask about Uma very discreetly. It's not a name you'd throw around just anywhere. And good luck. Actually, Rudy. we know the name Uma. <laughs> Don't get eaten. We know the name Uma because one of our cards is about someone named Uma. Which one was it? This one, yeah. Uma's Embrace. So we've heard of Uma. The bag brother. Yeah, he was a little shifty. But it's not like we have a lot of options, Dicey. Yeah, that is true. Soothsayer's tents. You have a better idea. 